Let's double check to see if they added any additional houses here. The biggest house is just Married's house. It's just, wait, it's got three floors? I think we have to go for it. I just feel like the scale of this home is so messed up compared to all the other ones. Like, look at this thing. What do we got? Honestly? Office. Ooh, this house is set up interesting. Bathroom. Basement! Oh! 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 Man cave! Wow. Why is this light switch at head level? We're making a sex dungeon in here. This is a sex dungeon. Ooh, is this a thermostat? That's an alarm system? Can I sell it? No. You know, you can't have a sex dungeon unless it's all black, right? Like, I feel like debauchery needs to happen in uh, under the cover of darkness here. You know, sex dungeons, you can be a completely normal, God-fearing individual and still have a all-black sex dungeon. You don't have to have it black and red. It could be purple. I'm just saying that I personally think our sex dungeon should indeed uh, you know, be dark. Get some wall panels. I'm a big fan of bright brick. See? That way it's industrial. I don't know how I want to feel about this one over here, okay? I, I have no idea. What do you think is going to go against this wall? Multi-purpose room, okay? Multi-purpose. So many purposes. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Um, alright, next thing we have to deal with is a, is a bed. Uh, obviously, oh, yeah. the bed is important here. It's got to be aesthetically pleasing. It's also got to, uh, you know, it's got to fit the space here. Can we get, I wish this was a little bit wow. bigger. Yeah, I feel like this fits the space, you know? I mean, you got places for the handcuffs. Like, what else are you going to be doing? I know a twin bed in your sex dungeon, not great. I personally would like it to be a king size or even a California king. But, uh, you know, like, what else could I do here? Oh, uh, I guess we could do this. That's too wide. Yeah, that's the one. 100%. That's the one. Let's go. Uh, yes, sir. Sconce numero uno. Sconce numero dos. Actually, I, should I be higher up? Or lower down? Let's turn them on first. That's not a light switch. Two is nice. Two's good. You know? It's just a there's a lot of light in here and I'm wondering if it's because the door doesn't exist. <laughs> we need uh next thing I don't think we can do this right though. Boo! This game sucks. Yeah, it'll work. Can I move this? Can I move you? Can you move? Can I move you? All right, we need something for the floor. Concrete is honestly the correct thing to have down here. Beige? Nothing says I have no desire to have sex anymore in my life than beige carpeting, okay? Uh, so we're not gonna do that. There you go. There you go. See? That works. See what I'm thinking? That works. Ain't no party like a bedside table party. Good old coffee table venge. <laughs> yeah. Look at that. Of course, y'all thought that we wouldn't have this. Like, I, I, I refuse. I think every house should have a good amount of sconces. Yeah, that's fine, you know? You can't put shit on the ceiling. All right, now we need to do the, uh, uh... You gotta make sure you have enough over here. You know, you know, people are... People have... People have pretty demanding kinks. You gotta make sure that you're... Stocked. Um, how could I have... How could I forget this? We need a... We need a solid shelving unit. This is kind of cute. Tell me I'm not crazy. Do the rugs look like they're different colors? <laughs> uh, Alright, we're gonna keep the two color rugs just because it makes the room not look shitty. Even the- oh, the lighting maybe? Yeah, maybe it is the lighting. What if I do- I really don't want an overhead light. So obviously we need a knife stand. Look, I don't know- I don't- I don't judge. Some people like boiling water. Red book? Don't know what we need to have the red book for, but I'm gonna put it in there. Just bring the color throughout the room. Mmm, first aid? Necessary. Canister, nuts, pickled cucumbers, your- wait. Just call them pickles. Gas mask, yes. You know, sometimes you just want to get freaky with it. I don't know what you're going to use it for. Uh, water bottles. You know, you just want to be hydrated. We'll make sure that people feel comfortable 
Why, of course we have peanut butter. Why would you even ask? Hey, Grizz! Come here! That's a loudspeaker? Fuck is the point? I don't know. I'm gonna put it back there anyways here. Three hundred dollars worth of loudspeakers. I'm not even gonna get to use. Oh yeah! Wait, we don't have a TV. How else are you supposed to watch porn? Where do I put it though? Back there? All right. So I said I move the ass picture here. So far, I think our sex dungeon came out pretty good. You know, I'd come in here and immediately feel like, yeah, I'm at home here. Tie me to the radiator. Wait, there's no radiator in the sex dungeon? This is Satan's summoning room. This is where we're gonna do it. Black. Where? There's no black. Diane, green, red? Silk red. There we go. Alright, so, uh, f we need tile floor. You wanna make sure that it's easy to clean up the chalk and all of the, uh, the wax from the melted candles, but you don't wanna- you don't wanna make it too crazy. How weird does this shit look? Oh my god, what the f- Alright, well let's see what this all looks like when we have black walls, okay? Devil-like lighting. Is it a chandelier? I mean this. Wait, really? Wait, 100% is this. What the fuck? Because there's no way that we can- you can't just light things up with candles. The only thing we can do is sconces. We gotta make an altar. Also, this floor has to go. I'm- I, we have to do white floors. I don't think we can do anything else. Like, purple's hideous. It's too sterile now! This looks like a race car room. If all the furniture in here is dark leather, this will work. Alright, but also, fuck that door. And let's put a... You know. You gotta have one of these dark door boys. So you walk in, you know, you're gonna be greeted with an altar, alright? It's so dark, I can't even fucking see it. You ever see a carpet and you just say to yourself, I would totally suck Satan's dick if it meant my knees could caress that carpet. I've said it. Uh, I don't have enough candles. Sir, what are you doing with 37 candles? You're at Michael's. Uh, you doing some crafts with these candles? Yes, ma'am. You betcha. Uh, this could be a library. Bathroom. Oh, you know I love me some bathrooms. All right, so what are we doing with this bathroom? Everything else kind of, kind of, kind of has to be normal. Let's let's start with our appliances here. I don't know if you guys saw, but they're actually putting in the house flipper. Big update. Big update. Plumbing means I can rearrange where things go in the bathroom. Give them the toilet flatty, aka the bidet boys. Is it like anal? Well, uh, no it's not. Believe it or not, having water splashed on your ass is not the same as being penetrated by a penis in your butt. Let's get a nice sink. One that commands attention, one that looks good. And we don't really have any. Alright, guess we're going with the standard black one. This could be cool. Uh, I mean, I like- alright, look, I like this color. This color is calming. I, I think this is like a sea foam. It's like a teal. I like this green. This green is actually really nice. And it works out well. I almost want to do these back walls. It's a pretty nice bathroom. Alright, we gotta get a, 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 we gotta get a carpet that brings the room together. Circular carpets and bathrooms. No? And then let's put a door. It's okay, it's not the end of the world. It's just not that great looking. I hate this color. That color sucks. There's no actual carpet that I want in here. And it's driving me in fucking insane. There's no toasters, man. I just don't want the- I don't know, this looks weird without a carpet. Alright, no carpet. Nobody's gonna take a bath down here, right? We're in the bat. yeah, nobody's taking a bath down here, we're in the bottom floor. No carpet needed. The fuck goes back there? This place sucks. Ooh, ooh. And look, it is even the same color. This is fine, we're not even gonna fuck around. Y y we're gonna put- I'll put, um, shelves up here. And then, yeah, there you go. Problem solved. So, we don't have any space for a dining room and it's pissing me off. Like, there's literally no dining room space here. However, I think we could make it work if we rearrange the kitchen to have... No. There's no way we can make it work. This table- this- this one specifically is hot. Never mind, not that one. Ignore what I said. This one specifically is hot. This one is- is solid. Good. So we need a carpet so it's a pain in the ass to clean up. Not really great. But it's alright, we'll figure it out. I mean, we could go with this. That's too small. I mean, we could go with this. And, you know, do like, uh, oh, the beige stripes. Is this bigger or smaller? It's about the same size. So. These ones, always big chair. Big vibe. But you're gonna have to go with these ones. Because, wow, this table is uncomfortably small. 
Maybe it's not bad. I was being too harsh. I was being way too harsh. You can tuck two chairs in there. That's good. You know, it really, it really is nice. Now, uh, I, I want to go back to this kitchen. And I, I, I want to, I want to lock down this giant kitchen sink, Andy. You want it black? Look at how much space this kitchen has. This kitchen has so much space. Could call it SpaceX. And then you've got your, 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 your oven. I don't, I think this, I don't think this adds shit. All right, I think this needs to go. And then we need to have like normal storage over here. They're all so different in sizes. Like, what the fuck is this? Like, who's going to be using a sink down here? It's like half the size. It's big tea time. Yes. All right. <laughs> but there's no space. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That, that looks. Oh, that's. I would eat breakfast on that little shelf. Look at this. You're just. Sizzling up some stir fry and you're throwing shit in the kitchen sink and then you're like, whoa, I gotta go get something from the from the From the fridge <laughs> Okay, okay <laughs> And then you run back over here, you know, we got to hit him with the gas stove I mean look this one looks better induction cooktop is actually the best way Why why is why is there a four burner gas stove an induction cooktop a four burner gas stove and a gas plate, but there is not, you know, a, a kitchen island. So, I want to do a backsplash. I've never done a kitchen backsplash, so I want the wall tiles. I want these big boys. I think that this pattern works well with things that are super, super, super modern. Like, um, if you really want, like, a, if you want, like, a test kitchen, um, this kind of, like, old-timey checkerboard pattern works well. Ooh, it's almost like a, it, it almost feels like a Frenchy kitchen kind of thing. If we used this with the brass accents, should I double this up? Can I double it up? Do I want to? Why is, I'm sorry, why is this white not the same white as that white? Are all whites not the same in this game? All right, I don't hate this. It is a little dark, but I think this would work. Well, I'm just talking about with this. I'd have to get rid of those two. This area is gorgeous. And I freaking love it. All right, this looks great. I would love to live here. Excited for the library. Like I said, I've not done it yet. So libraries, rich mahogany, whole lot of bullshit. We need a really, really warm color here. So we're gonna use this. We're gonna use really. Uh, we're gonna use a uh, carpeted floor. Actually, no, we should do hardwood. All right. The thing that I'm worried about is having too much dark colors. I'm worried about not being able to fill all of this stuff, so let's... I think... Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, it doesn't take away too much. It's alright. Put a lamp here. Uh, overhead light, I don't know how I feel about it, but we'll keep it. It, it probably is gonna be too dark, but let's just get the shit that we need first. I need the comfiest chair. No, no, no. Really? All of these chairs suck. What about sofa? Black leather, navy, leather leather. Uh, let's put like a storage compartment here. Something up there. I should have moved the fireplace in here. You know, this is kind of like some knockoff Gucci shit. I don't know how I feel about it. The fireplace is nice, but I don't know how I feel about it. It doesn't make any sense. Right, I don't like the fact that the couch is not centered. Put one here. Put one... It just won't be centered with the window, and that's a that's something we're gonna have to live with. That's too crowded. That's way too crowded. These chairs are too big. If I had smaller chairs, we could make it work. I think we should stick with. I mean, it's actually not that crowded. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. I like it. It works. Let's get a side table going that that fits it. If it's a library, it needs to be cozy. It needs to feel welcoming, and this does a good job. You have your books over here. That's a lot of books, by the way. Here, um. I'm just gonna put artwork here. You've got your lights. Is this even on? Yeah, that's on. Oh man, that's the coziest room ever. One there. Let's go back upstairs. All right, so now we have this monstrosity, this shithole, and there's no light switch in the hallway. Which one's gonna be the master bedroom? What about the lighting? Honestly, the pff, the lighting is fine. I don't mind. Wait, I ooh, the lights. 
Oh, that can't, we can't have that happening. I'm sorry, we can't have that happening. Fuck it. You know what? Look at this, it's a goddamn hallway. Hold on. Sell you. I need to knock you down. Alright, so we're gonna put, we'll, we'll design the room and then we'll, we'll design the room and then we'll put down the, uh, the door. So we put a wall here. I'm gonna build it out right now, because I can just destroy it later. I want, I want, I want some space around the bedroom, like this. That is so far away. Wait, wait, wait. Everybody, chill the fuck up. Got an idea. Oh, should I center it? I don't know if I should center it. I like that room break a lot, but now the uh, honestly, it's okay. It's just a little too narrow on either side. So you'll walk in. There's gonna be a wall on one side. TV's gonna be against this wall. Oh, no, 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 wall against, oh, no, is it gonna be in the way? I don't like how dark the color of the, uh, bed is compared to this. Do we hate it? It's kind of nice, but the color doesn't match. You post up here, you've got, you just, you just hang out here, and you just, that's a cuddle angle right there. You just tuck yourself into that back corner of the bed. We're changing the carpet. Plants in the back right corner. The bed still works. This works really well, but it's too big. Like, this actually has all the colors and shit that I want in it. That's nice. That'll work. So I need to do something here. We need a side cupboard. Why are they all different colors? All right, this. Mirror. Mirror on the wall. Should we double up on this? Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. We need another door in here. Let's just carry it into the into the bedroom or the the master bath slash bath in general. Let's get this one sorted. Ooh, it's marble topped. I'm not getting rid of that. That's nice. All right, we need to put in some home appliances, as they say. I kind of want to keep that, but I don't want it to be super sterile. But it's a bathroom, so let's have some fun with the floor tiles because that's kind of like the the remaining area. I just don't like a lot of these floor tiles. Oh. Fuck it. Why not? Full send. Hi, my name's Tucker, and that's a terrible idea. Light blue? Maybe that doesn't distract as much. Light blue is the winner. Clear winner here. Uh, we should put, like, a little a little table of some sorts. Ooh, and we can get it in gray. In gray. Well, look at that. Now, you know what we're going to put on there. Everybody's favorite is a fern. But here's where the kicker comes in. Hit him with that blue. Blue is now our accent color. Oh, it is. Blue is now our accent color. I love this bedroom. I'm just going to say it right now. This is, the best, this is the best shit we ever made. I mean, I don't care that it doesn't look flawless. It is probably the best shit we've ever made. A moment like this. Some people wait a lifetime. I'm going to keep it. It's not bad. It's okay. That's like all I can say. It's not... It's. It does the job. I personally wouldn't... I'm saying within the confines of what we have, it does the job. Yeah, but it's not its not bad at all. I really, really like the fact that when you have the, I wanna like, I love the fact that the lights are only behind you. That means you're slumbering, you know? You got this nice dark little nook, you're feeling really good. All of a sudden your, your significant other or your parents come in, they slap on that light switch and bam! You're awake but you're not offended because the lights aren't in your face. All right, let's do, this is going to be kids' bedroom numero uno, and this can be, chi like, baby bedroom, you know what I mean? All right, beds. Kids' room. No, there are bunk beds. Fuck it. This is a bed with a desk. This is terrible. I think we do two side-by-side -side short boys, you know what I'm saying? And then we have one thing in the middle. What is going on with the lighting? What is, where is this light even coming from? What's underneath there? The halogens. Are you freaking kidding me? No, ooh. And... You know what? Fine, works for me. Turn to beach. Really extend that boy sideways. See how much space we can get off of this. Oh, a hundred percent. Here, um, honestly, that's the space for the door to swing out because realism, and that's a hundred percent what we're talking about here. Oh yeah. Oh yes. 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 Office chair, probably better. When you open the door, it's not gonna hit the mirror. It might hit the dresser. It does. Do I care? No. Realism doesn't matter. 
Everything is dead. I do care, actually. You know? I like it. Woo! We did it. We done did it. Did it. Did it. Did it. Did it. Did it. I'm putting a. I'm putting a whiteboard up there. Shit. This is like the only color rug that I think fits that. Cyan. Cyan. I need an overhead light. Yeah. 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 Let's get these little fucking donkey. Look, you both get bears. It's adorable. Nobody's more important. This room has a significant lack of uh, shelf space. Word, word, word. All right, cool. I think this kid's room is solid. I we do need a we need we need to we need to get a good picture. It's got to be cyan. All right. Now that we got that sorted. From here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna sort out the. Is this gonna be baby's room? I like what you got going on. All right, we'll put this against the wall. Uh, let's put a a a a a a a a rocket chair, floor lamp, tube, boom. No, that's too harsh though. That's too harsh of a color. It needs to be warm and inviting. It's got to be like mama material. I'm gonna tuck it away in this corner here. Right? It's uh, God, that's such a hideous bed. Is there really not an easier one to? White, light blue. I think light blue is better. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's do some storage first. Cupboards. Storage. Oh, it's stylish. It's big. And it takes up a lot of space. Like, these are the best in the game. This is fine. This is literally fine. There's nothing anybody else needs. This works. When you when you see the house tour, you're going to be blown away by the features this home offers, okay? Yeah, that's a good color. Nice spot in the doorway. That's covered up. Don't worry about it. I like beige. Beige is a good carpet. I don't know what to put. This is such an absurd amount of space. Okay, bedroom. Bed. Room. Bedroom. Bedroom. We need a sizable boy. Oh, that's nice. I like that. That's very adult-like. Can I enclose the staircase? Wait, that could be a... You're, you're almost brilliant. Oh my god, we're doing it. Let's go. Thank God for enclosed bedrooms. Let me holla at you, boy. I'm thinking, no matter what, we need the sofa, like the sizable one. White leather, red leather, what the hell, leather, blue leather, and black with flowers. No. Do they have beanbag chairs in here? Poof is what it's called. Wall panel, light, brick, all Z way light brick is the best. If I got the hiccups, it's really uncomfortable. I just want you to know three might be too much. Oh, I don't know. It is. I don't give a shit. I'm keeping it, and there's nothing you could say that would convince me otherwise. Hit him with a plant. You know what I'm saying, dude? Hit him with a plant. Ceiling lamp. You you you. Right on top of the bed. Boom. Never mind. In the middle? At all? This is a guest bedroom. All right, it works. Where's my light switch? All right, real quickly, let's go back to the living room. This is storage area. Fuck you. It's an unfinished basement. We need a beefy uh, uh, cupboard slash whatever the hell you want to call it, TV stand. Here's the thing. When you are building a home like this, you're never thinking like, is this too many TVs? You're thinking... How many more TVs can I put in here? It's honestly not bad. Brown's not gonna work. Beach is not gonna work. White wood? No. Okay, I'm gonna do something that's crazy. It's pretty fucking zany. I don't want you guys to freak out, so I'm just letting you know if you have any young children in the room, please. If you have any young children in the room, please ask them to leave. I'm putting a spatial rug on top of a carpet. The only reason that I'd say this is too much is because this wall is not brick. I mean, this wall is brick. If I painted that white, this would look just fine. Well, let's get a chaise. Fuck it, dude. We're running with it. All right? We're running with it. I have an idea. We're going to add some cursed images. This is the home, and hopefully you guys enjoy. So we only have 37 grand left. Uh, I didn't do as much of the micromanaging as I should have, but let's take you in here, and first thing you're greeted with is a fireplace in the hallway. Some skeptics say this isn't possible. I said it is possible, 
and um, not only that, but I'm going to do it. So I put a fireplace in the hallway to keep the hallway warm so everybody who walks in wow. is warm. We walk in here and you have the living room and it's a pretty nice uh, uh, kitchen slash living room, except it's not a living room, it's a dining room and the living room's downstairs. What we got here is a brand new modern kitchen tea form. Shout out my tea pose boys. On the left hand side, you got yourself your oven and your gas burn stove, plenty of storage. You've got a nice little nook so you can eat in, uh, it, it, during breakfast. On the right hand side, you got your refrigerator. Got a whole lot of space for storage. Nice classic halogen lights up top. Let's see what they look like. Gorgeous, such even lighting throughout the home. I'm gonna turn these off though so I get FPS. Over here, place to store your fine china. Do you have fine china? I don't know. And then a, a, a nice, simple, uh, eating area, you know, it's it's really nice. It brings the whole room together. Uh, it's great. So let's see here. On on the left hand side, we have ourselves a beautiful library. This is where Dad's gonna come and uh, and relax. You know, you fill this with your books. This is Dad's sanctuary. You don't interrupt him here. It's just nice and comfortable. Not only that, but it's just you know, it's it's just roomy and comfortable. Uh, this is where you read your newspapers, and it's nice. It's nice. Over here we have the bathroom. The bathroom, uh, we decided to keep this nice little teal area. Nobody, Nobody's going to go down to this bottom bathroom and take a bath, okay? So just ignore that. But we decided to have it in case you want it. Uh, shelves can be filled with whatever you want, but we have, we, have some pretty nice, we have some pretty nice little shitting areas over here. And this toilet has a bidet. Like, what else could you want? Into this uh, very special room. This is a warship room. Uh, not everybody is of the same denomination of faith, so I ask you to respect my worship room. So this is um, where I hail Satan. Uh, we walk in here, and you've got the upside-down uh, cross. And, you know, you just kind of, you can do whatever you want to do here. You could kneel, you can grab the knife, you can do whatever. Point is, this is really where I feel at home. God, I wish this show was better. Done hailing Satan. Let's go upstairs. Uh, I hate this. Um, I hate this this wood, but I can't replace it, so it is what it is. Up here, we're gonna change wood. Let's go straight into the uh, baby's room. So you walk in, the door's installed the wrong way, or is it? It's not. It just blocks you from seeing your hideous child for about five more seconds. You got your AR-15 on the wall in case you need to defend it from someone who is trying to rob your baby. Very popular thing nowadays. You know, babies fetch a high price on the secondary market, so you gotta, you know, defend them. A place for you to have your baby boy place for you to change your baby girl who knows doesn't matter to me non-binary it's 2018 who interrupted my tour anyways rocking chairs so you can rock them to sleep and uh, plenty of areas so you can just house all of your baby's jordans because we all know your baby's gonna wear jordans now that we're done with that room Let's go into the children's room. I wanted to make this a room that felt like it could uh, accommodate two people. So we've got the nice mirror, uh, light combo. Mirror, honestly, I'm going to move it over for you. You know, if this is free of charge. You don't have to, you don't have to spend money wow. for that. Plenty of area for you to store your clothes. And you got two beds for your chilling. Beautiful teal, gorgeous, stuffed animals, place for them to do the homework. Like, there's not much more you could ask for. This is a great kid's room. Let's go into the bathroom here. Got our nice little baby blue tiles. Really clean bathroom. Cherubs, I mean cherubs, on the wall. So you can pee while you look at the uh, babies. Um, you get a heated towel rack and a nice little plant and a full shower. What more could you want? Ladies and gentlemen, let's go into the master bedroom. Spend a lot of time remodeling this. Okay? A lot of time remodeling this. Let's walk in here. We've got a, a nice painting on the left-hand side here. And look at this. Look at this bedroom. This used to be two bedrooms. Now, not anymore. We've got one big master bedroom. Plenty of space to store your loved one's belongings. A fucking lovely bed. Spacious. Beautiful carpet. Nice little sitting area so you can nag your wife, husband, and or others. And then a TV room. We tried to draw in the green throughout the, the, the area. It was tough, but it's not that bad. It's not that bad. 
Over here we have the closet area because we know you're going to be stacking tons of shirts and shit. Plants, mirror to get ready. This opens into the bedroom. Well, let's go down in the basement. I mean, the bathroom is what I was talking about. Let's go down in the basement. Down in this basement, this is where your living room is. You know, obviously we have uh, the friendship corner, which is where you store all your photos of friendship. You know, we have a, a two blank walls. That just means you have a lot of friends to make, and that's a wonderful thing to have. On these uh, these walls, we've got Dad's favorite, you know? The Lego Movie, one of his favorites, um, and Fortnite, one of his favorite games. But this is fun for the whole ha family. You can just kind of hang out and, uh, and, and, and just watch TV. Accent wall, you can do what you want with it. You can paint it, but I like the exposed brick. It's good. We've got ourselves... Uh, the guest bedroom, so if your family or your parents or in-laws ever want to stay down here, they're more than welcome to do so. TV, lighting, storage, plants, bed, that's all you need in a bedroom, right? Am I right? I'm right. Last but not least, we have our favorite room, the sex dungeon. So this is, uh, you walk in, we've got our casting couch with the TV on the left-hand side, a lot of sconces, some 360-degree audio, first aid kit, water, knives, uh, a pot and kettle, trophy gas mask, cucumbers, candles, peanut butter, a knife, uh, a book of the secrets, a lot of toilet paper, and the ass photo. Oh man, Giorgio, the bottom of the barrel. Three, six, five! Oh, we're breaking hundo! Oh! Three, seven, nine! Jantart family! Pump it up to 408! Johnson? Blaze it! Ow! Oh! 435 grand, 150k profit. I. Your boy has never seen that number before. 